thân từ khe trần đến từ hậu sĩ sĩ sài gòn anh em có ai đến từ thành phố hồ chí minh mang cái bát mà ờ tuyệt vời ok thì first one want to thank the hậu sĩ sĩ and the all the team for this celebrating now we mentioned about vietnam and the service so we have two questions actually one for sĩ sĩ and one for mr b it's okay right Okay, the first question is uh, because now we we mentioned about NFT, but we asking about the university, the university for the community, especially in Vietnam. So, can you, CC, can you please just try to just review some main point? What you gonna do to ed educate the Vietnam community, especially the Vietnam market, to know more about NFT? This is the question for you. And the question for Mr. Peter. Uh, okay, as you know that in, in Vietnam, in private, in private and also in Southeast Asia, do we have any place for energy reactor? Can be reacting, can be trading, as well as can be make the collection or do the auctions inside the marketplace. We mentioned about energy marketplace. Thank you so much. Okay, um, I hope I understand the question correctly, but uh, from our perspective, uh, number one, we're providing a marketplace for NFTs, uh, so we would love to have more uh, community, community particip uh, participation and also creator participation for uh, if you want to issue, create your own NFTs, try to sell them, um, uh, work on the local economy. With the universities, we definitely want to increase the amount of education we do. Um, and uh, we also want to look at new applications for NFTs. Um, university diplomas is a, is a, is a, is a, is a classic exam example of an NFT. Um, so maybe we can work with universities to, to, to make that uh, uh, project going. Um, and there's many, many other ways. I'm, I'm usually not the right person. So the way Binance works is, is bottom up. I don't design things and tell other people what to do. If we do that, Binance will be a disaster. Uh, because um, uh, uh, like I don't have the bandwidth, I'm not smart enough. Um, so it really depends on our uh, NFT teams and communities uh, for them to come up with uh, uh, with new ideas. Uh, my job is to make sure that they have the freedom to do what they need to do, and then the support, funding, uh, human uh, uh, teams, etc. Yeah. You know, because at the moment, not so many people know about NFT, especially in Vietnam market. So now. I mean about the universality in the way we are getting the people to come to know more about the NFT, especially that's the main the, the main question about the place. I don't think there's a I don't think there's a magical answer to it. Um, you know, conferences like this um, helps um, more education helps, but more importantly, I think having a proper platform so that we make sure that you know. The, the quality controls, uh, there are user protection mechanisms in place um, that has sustained long term growth uh, is the key. Uh, short term, we can advertise more, we can push more um, if the regulations locally allow it, uh, but that, those are short term things. Uh, whereas I typically encourage our teams to focus on long term steady growth uh, factors. Thank you, thank you. 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 Thank you.